Hello friends, this video trigonometry part 16 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched trigonometry part 1 to part 15. Let's take some trigonometric function in this form 1 plus minus x square. When you say 1 plus 10 square x, this becomes x square x. When you say 1 plus cot square x, this becomes cos x square x. And you say 1 minus sin square x, this becomes cos square x. Now we'll prove this. So let's use the same old mantra Pandit Badri Prashad Hari Hari Bo. That means P by B is equal to sine B by H. P by H is equal to sine. B by H is equal to cos and P by B is equal to tan. And the just reverse is cosec, I like cosec here also because this is reverse of this cosec, sec reverse is, cos reverse is sec and reverse of tan is cos, we know this so when we say 1 plus tan square x so we can write this as 1 plus tan is equal to p by b p square by b square so if you take b square common this becomes b square plus p square so we know that in a right triangle, if this is H, this is B and this is P and B. So B square plus P square is equal to H square. So this becomes H square. So this becomes H square by B square. So H square by B square, you know, is sec theta because B by H is cos theta. So H by B is sec theta. So this becomes sec square. Yes. So we have proved this. Similarly for 1 plus cot square x, this will become cot is nothing but tan is p by b. So cot is just reverse of that, this will become b by p. You square this, so what you get is p square into common, this becomes p square plus b square. And p square plus b square we know is again h square, become h square by p square. h by p is in this. So this is h by p is cosec because p by h is sine. So this becomes cosec square x. Similarly, we will take 1 minus sine square x. So sine is equal to p by h. So this becomes 1 by p square by h square. So this becomes h square by h square minus p square. h square minus p square, if you take here, this becomes b square. So this becomes b square by h square and b by h we know is cos so this becomes y square x. So thus we have proved all these three formulas. It's pretty simple. Just we have to use Pandit Badri Prashad Hari Hari board and you will get Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.